Hey everybody, welcome back. Dell to Play Gaming, back again with some more of Final Fantasy X. And I apologize because right, Rides after, is super. right after I sneak or save my All game, aboard. I have a really bad allergies, so if I sound a little like congested, I apologize. I'm gonna try and keep the sniffles down. I just hate this time of the year and in fall because. You pop launching! Just, you know, pollen and dander. Yeah, fun times. Hey. What? Huh? Take a look. What? Whoa! A sunken city. A machina city, a thousand years old. They built the city on top of bridges across a river. But the weight of the city caused the bridges to collapse, and it all sank to the bottom. Right. It's a good lesson. A lesson? Don't build cities on yeah. bridges. Why build a city over a river, yeah? Uh, well, it would be convenient with all that water there. Nope, that's not nope. why. They just wanted to prove they could defy the laws of nature. Hmm? I'm not so sure about that. Yevon has taught us. When humans have power, they seek to use it. If you don't stop them, they go too far, yeah? Yeah, but don't you use Machina too? Like the stadium and stuff, right? Yevon, it decides which Machina we may use and which we may not. So, it sounds so like what kind of machina may we not use then? Remember Operation Meehan? That kind. Or war will rage again. War? More than a thousand years ago, mankind waged war using machina to kill. They kept building more and more powerful machina. They made weapons so powerful, it was thought they could destroy the entire world. The people feared that Spira would be destroyed. But the war did not stop. Wh what happened then? Sin came, and it destroyed the cities and their machina. Shouldn't he The war this? ended, and our reward was Sin. So, Sin's our punishment for letting things get out of hand, eh? Man, that's rough. Yeah, it is. But it's not like the Machina yeah. are bad. And he's got to be Only as bad right? as their users. It's because of because... people like the Albed screwing everything up. Well, like, think about it this way. Like, he <laughs> has to be... What could that he, be? You have to know that there was a city built on the like, you know, what was it? Um, Sit down. The Venice Sorry! Isn't ah! that one? That's, the Albed! No, not so much built, but they're like, they're still just like towns that are surrounded, that are really surrounded by water. So he should know that. What's that? Oh, there's a city down there? That's built up. Luna, we'll save you! No, it just, I don't know. It just, to me, it sounds a little hard to. Uh, it's. It's weird. But anyways, we are in a boss fight. Alright, so cheer. Let's get our top up and going. This is the uh blitz bomb machine from way back in the game. Slap that ball. Cheer again, because I believe it stacks. Times. Stracto ability mode. Alright, 
right, let's get this going. Shit, that's all I did after... Alright, fine. Yeah, Waka, you are... Oh, wait, it's because... Yeah, it's because of, uh... Tidus' weapon. Because it's got, I think, fire in the water. Let's put a high potion on Titus. So it must be damage based. Thousand AP for that. Two ability spheres and an ice brand. Are you hurt? Of course, there's a truck driving behind me. Uh, no, I'm fine. Oh, oh. those out bed. Ish, everybody okay? I I'm sorry. We're all okay now. Yuna. Super full speed ahead. Damn the outbed. What do they want from us? Could it have something to do with Luca? I don't know, maybe. What do they have the uniform? Wait. They're mad they lost the tournament. Oh wait! They're mad about Operation Meehan! I wonder. Didn't Kamari's clansmen say something about summoners disappearing? Uh, don't you remember so that? So the out better behind that. Again? Those sand plastic grease monkeys. Hey, that sounded racist. Hey, Waka. Knock it the fuck off. It's no use complaining about the owl bed now, right? We'll protect Yuna from anyone, anywhere. It's that easy. That's all I need to know. Well, I guess so. You're right. <laughs> all right, now we're on the other 
side of the beach. Kimari fail as guardian on Shubham. Kimari never fail again. Uh, you're all right there, dude. No harm, no foul. It's, you know. It is what it is. Might be more out bed. Keep watch, yeah? Hey, Zelda's back there. The Triforce. Looks like we're stuck here for a while. Hey, let me go talk to you now. This is where we get Riku. You're not dead? <laughs> it sounds like he's like, ugh, you're not dead? Uh, uh? You should be. First time ever seeing a woman strip in front of him. Uh -huh. ah, I was done for back there. Ah. Riku! You're Riku! Uh, hey! Uh, you're okay! How you been? Terrible. Yeah, you don't look so good. What happened? You beat me up, remember? Huh? Oh, that Machina? That was you? Mm-hmm. Oh, that really hurt, you know. You big meanie. <sighs> w wait, but you attacked us! Nuh-uh, it's not exactly what you think. No, technically you did. Yo! Friend of yours. Uh, and you could say that. Pleased to meet ya. I'm Riku. Yuna, Lulu, I told you about her, remember? She was the one who helped me before I was washed up on Besaid. She's an owl bed. Ah. Ah. Wow, so you like all your life. What luck meeting here, huh? Praise be to Yevon. Even she's like, uh, what? So, uh, Riku, you look a little beat up. You okay? Uh, Waka. Huh? What? There's something we need to discuss. Oh, go ahead. Girls only. Boys, please wait over there. Right. Sorry, Waka. Huh? What? Sir Oren, I would like Riku to be my guardian. You don't have to ask for permission. Show me your face. Huh? Look at me. Oh, okay. Open your eyes. 
as I thought. Um, no good? Are you certain? A hundred percent. So, anyway... Can I? If Yuna wishes it. Yes, I do. She ends up becoming one of the most Riku's powerful characters in the game. good girl. She helped me a bunch. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm for it. The more the merrier. Right-o. Then I'll just have to be the merriest. It was strange. Even though Waka had always hated the Albed. Riku, at your service. He never realized Riku was one of them. Well, he's not exactly the brightest bulb in the box. But, no judging, because again, oh, he chest. also becomes one of the most powerful characters in the game. Yes, let me... Wonder what's inside. I just got on you. You'll be sorry. Is the fact that she doesn't get what did you just do? She blew it up. That was great. I can combine items and use them like this. It's not that tough, really. Anyways, she doesn't get any sphere levels from like the time that I leave her up until now. She doesn't get a single thing, which kind of sucks because trying to use her in battle. the greatest. I'll do my best. See her HP is Perfect. Some off camera grinding to 
get Riku at least somewhat close to where the house is going. Or somewhere you can recruit one of the best goalies in the game for Blitzball. We have been expecting you, Lady Yuna. Welcome to Guado Salam. This way, my lady. This way. Uh, uh, me? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I beg your pardon. I am called Trommel Guado. I am in the direct service of our leader, the great Seymour Guado. Lord Seymour has very important business with Lady Yuna. Business with me? Whatever could it be, I wonder? Please, come inside the manor. All will be explained. Of course, your friends are also welcome. Twist our arms, why don't you? Ah, I almost forgot. That's right. This is where we get the best uh, ability in the game. Let's start making our characters into gods. This is just, I don't know, just kind of like just bringing back nostalgia of just, you know, the old PS2 days, just playing through, you know, again, because this came out, I was a, this was 2001, so junior, senior in high school when it came out, you know, get done class on Friday, what would you do without me? all day Saturday play. Such a great game. But this is where I'm going to end it for today. And I'll talk a little bit about it next time. But I will see you guys in the next video.